Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Plus Size in Canada. I am Miranda and you are about to watch another week in my life. So today is Saturday and originally Curtis and I had planned to go Christmas shopping, but my sister and her kids are in town. So we have scratched that idea. Um, we will not be able to finish our Christmas shopping today and that is just fine with me because I'm going to spend the day with my sister and her kids. So that's really fun. I probably will not vlog any of that. Um, I do have to run to town tonight with at least Cooper, if not everyone, um, because his feet grew and he needs new sneakers. So, you know, why not? It's December and you have to buy your kids sneakers. Other, <laughs> Add it to the list, you know? Um, so yeah, we are doing that. I bet town will be insane, but it is what it is. You got to do what you got to do. So, um, yeah, I will check in with you guys later. Welcome to another weekly vlog. I'm so glad you're here. Not even in the real lineup yet. Might be a while. Shh. I have my jammies on and we just set up our ship for the first time in 2019. So let's take a look and see what he's up to this first night. We have our Polar Express train on our other tree and on our live tree, Sheppy thought it'd be a good idea to set up his own train track <laughs> with chocolate kisses. There's also chocolate kisses inside his little train tin. So let's see which kid will find him first in the morning. It's always a hunt to see who wins. <laughs> there he is. Sheppy. What did he do? Your kid a unicorn saying hi? Yeah. Look, behind him. Is that his train? What is it? Chocolate kisses. Yummy. And his little sign says, I'm back. Christmas 2019. Why don't you check out Sheppy's train, Winnie? You want to pick it up? Pick up Sheppy's train. Yeah. What's inside? Sheppy. Check the front. Some treats. You didn't know that, did you, Sky? <laughs> Pretty fun. Thank you, Chef. Chef thought we needed a train under this tree too. I think. Yes. Now we can eat our chocolate calendar. It's eight ten, and Skyler, this guy woke up at six fifty to find Chef, and woke Mommy up along with him. <laughs> now we're gonna have our chocolate calendars. The first one. Pretty exciting. So Curtis and I also got this Christmas countdown from Atlantic Lottery. <laughs> um, so I already opened this little door. This is number 24. It says, don't forget to hang your stocking. And I am going to scratch it and see what we got. This is the first time we've ever gotten one of these. And we don't normally do scratch off cards, but Curtis loves doing them. So I always get them for like his birthday and Father's Day and stuff. Okay. So we got a star, and I don't know what that means. <laughs> so on the back it has a little like checklist, so if you get a certain amount of each symbol, then you win that prize. So we got one star on our way to $25. So Curtis read the full instructions, and if we had have gotten another um, $200,000, we would have won instantly $200,000. Yeah, okay. We were two-thirds of the way from winning it. It's pretty <laughs> Anyways, close. there's two ways to win. You can win with um, collecting the symbols, or also you can have an instant win of prize money right away. So, here's hoping. Almost won it. <laughs>
anticipated and now anticipates anew the reign of an anointed one, a Messiah who will bring peace and justice and righteousness to the world. Today, we light the candle of hope. As we light this candle, we draw our eyes to the anticipation that the Israelites had, that Mary and Joseph had. We draw our hearts and our minds to the hope of the world, Jesus Christ, his life on earth, his presence with us today, and his soon return. All give us hope for a life spent with him, both now and forevermore. Let's pray. Happy Sunday, you guys. So Winnie and I went to church by ourselves today. Curtis had to take the boys to Grand Bay yet again for basketball, but I needed to be at church this Sunday for junior church class. So um, are you saying hi? Yeah. Yeah? So we had fun at church. It's about one o'clock now, and we're going to have lunch, and then Winnie is going to a birthday party. So that means mom has two hours this afternoon by herself. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I might just clean, maybe watch a movie. I don't know. We'll see how I feel in one hour, but I'm so excited. This never happens that I actually have two hours off to myself where I have nothing else to be doing. So I will let you know. I will check back in and tell you what I am doing. <laughs> Winnie is about to go get changed for her birthday party that she's going to, but I wanted to show you her beautiful dress. Look how pretty she looks. Can you do a little twirl, Win? Woo! So beautiful. I absolutely love it. She looks like a princess, huh? Thank you, Winnie. <laughs> All right, so it is now 3.03 on Sunday afternoon. I brought Winnie to her party at two o'clock and I have to pick her up at four. So I have one hour left. I just sat here for about 25 minutes and filmed a positivity challenge tag video that Stephanie from Irinati Adventures sent over to me. So that should be uploaded to the channel by the time this vlog is. I think I'm gonna plan on editing that tomorrow morning. Like I said in my last vlog, um, I'm gonna try to post extra in um, December, just but I'm not gonna do Vlogmas because of the new rules from YouTube, it's all weird. Um, anyways, so that's gonna be one of my extra videos. So thank you so much, Stephanie, for sending that over to me. So I have about one hour left. I'm going to take off these friggin' church clothes, go put some comfy clothes on, and blast my Christmas tunes, clean this place up, and maybe even open my closet and go through the boys' Christmas presents. So I am all done Winnie's. I'm done wrapping her presents. I still haven't done her stocking and we still have something we need to build. <laughs> Santa needs to. Anyway, so we haven't done that yet, but for the boys, I haven't started wrapping their um, presents that go under the tree. What I like to do is, um, make sure it's fair, especially for them because they're so close in age and they'll notice if somebody gets something more than the other one. But I also don't like to buy them the same things over and over because they're not super young. Like they're into different things. And um, so anyways, so what I would like to do and what I need to do very soon is get um, everything out of my secret Christmas closet and, you know, pile up what's for Skylar, pile up what's for Cooper and see what the heck do I need to buy? What is left on my list? There is not much. I know there's not much, but I just need to make sure, I'm one of these people, <laughs> type A, I just need to make sure that I have everything that I need, and if there's something else more that I need, it's going down on another list, and I will buy that this week. I am going to be rapping like a mad woman this week, you know, <laughs> in West Philadelphia, born, not that kind of rapping. Um, <laughs> Christmas present wrapping all this week. I know I have to hit it hard, 
because I did not meet my goal. I'm so close. It is December 1st. I wanted to have everything done by December 1st, but it's just not going to happen this year. Um, my sister brought her kids over. They were here almost all day yesterday, so we didn't get an opportunity to go Christmas shopping. So that's fine. I had a great day with my sister and her kids, and um, they live three hours away. So when they're here, I need to spend time with them, of course. Um, so anyways, it's 3.06. I'm running out of time. The Christmas music needs to happen. Oh, if you watch my positivity challenge tag, you'll know where this came from. Thank you, Winnie. Um, <laughs> anyways, all right. Clothes are coming off. You're not going to watch that part. I'm going to clean. I'll talk to you guys later. So I got lots of cleaning done. I got a lot of Christmas present stuff done. And I picked Winnie up from her birthday party. We stopped at the grocery store on the way home to pick up a couple things for supper. And um, yes, now I am in my jammies. That's happening. I just got changed out of my comfy clothes into even comfier clothes, my jammies. I washed my face. I feel like a brand new woman. I usually use, and I always use, makeup that is good for sensitive skin, makeup that works for me. Um, but I think my skin is just only getting more sensitive as I'm getting older or maybe I'm just freaking sick of putting crap on my face. I don't know. My eyes get so irritated now if I wear makeup for more than two hours. Like all I wanna do is this, <laughs> you know what I mean? I really take for granted when I'm not wearing makeup that I can do this. And when I'm wearing makeup, it's like, oh, I just wanna rub my eyes. So anyways, now I'm fresh faced, jammies are on. Um, yeah, Skylar I think has youth group tonight, but that's okay. I can drive you to youth group and pick you up from youth group in my jammies. I'm cute. It's fine. I'm staying in the car. If anybody wants to say hey to me, they can come over to my window and scout out the jammies of the day, okay? I'm fine with that. Um, anyways, yeah, so I'm going to go cook supper, and the boys should be home really soon from basketball. Curtis is headed to work again tonight once they get back. Uh, I am planning an evening of wrapping Christmas presents. I'm excited. Hallmark Christmas movies, glass of ice water, and wrapping. It sounds amazing. And I cannot wait a few more hours and I will be there. You know that feeling? when it's been a long day. See my cheeks? Yeah, it's been a long day, friends. And it's seven o'clock at night. I actually had a new um, kid start in my daycare today, so it's been a little busy. Um, and now I am heading out to a board meeting at my church. So super fun. <laughs> the meeting's gonna be about an hour long, and then I have to rush back and get Winnie to bed. Thankfully, my lovely boys are taking care of her for now. Curtis is at a fire dinner, a fire dinner, a, a volunteer firefighter Christmas dinner. And anyways, lots going on. Anyways, I will check in later. Hopefully my meeting is super fun. <laughs> Running late as always, but I got my ice water, got my bag full of crap. <laughs> and of course, flexing on this Christmas shirt with, you can't tell, but sweatpants. <laughs> it's a church meeting, guys. Back home, just in time to get Winnie to bed. Thankfully, I only live about five minutes from our church. Um, so yeah, makes it easy for days like today. Let's see if the door is locked. Oh, it's unlocked. She's already going to bed. Oh, I can't. Daddy. But her daddy was busy decorating the tree. She got Mommy! But her mom was busy story. wrapping one last Christmas Mama. present. Hi, honey. She yelled, Andrew! <laughs> Andrew! But her brother was Robert putting Munch out book. a plate of cookies for Santa. Julie even yelled, Tyra! But her sister had Cute. gone to sleep. I'm gonna on put the this couch. camera away and sit on the couch to finish the story. Mm -hmm. Curtis brought me home a treat from his dinner a rose and one of my very favorite desserts. 
from the Big Stop. <laughs> Jerry Cheesecake. Yummy. Jerry Cheesecake. <laughs> All right, let's get you to bed, little Missy. Missy. Sheppy is hiding in the bathroom tonight and brought the kids a special present for tomorrow. I think tomorrow might be a snow day, so I figured a great day to crack out the new markers. They'll be surprised, especially Winnie, of course. Good morning, it's Tuesday and Mama was right, there is no school today, it has been canceled. Look what's going on outside. Listen to that hail. Yeah, the roads are probably a little bad this morning. It's fallen. Very, very grateful. I have nowhere to go today. You can stay home, stay safe. The kids are going to be home. Very grateful. Glad to have this nice warm house to stay in. And of course, and of there's course, a fire call. And of course, there's a fire call. I survived another snow day. <laughs> so it was a good day. Um, I played lots of games with my kids. We even got to watch um, the Santa Claus number two on Disney Plus. Loving Disney Plus. So many options. So happy with that. Um, it's about 6.45 right now. We actually got takeout for supper just because I was wrapping Christmas presents. Things are going good if you wanted to know. Um, and we just had a busy day. Obviously, I had to cook for everyone at lunchtime. So, you know, I also made breakfast and there was a lot of dishes already been done today and I just was ready. I was like, let's order out for supper. And of course, everyone agreed. So it is 645, like I said, and um, Curtis actually had the idea of building a fort with the kids and telling me to go take a bath. And I thought that was a great idea. <laughs> Who takes a bath this early in the evening? That's a mom. It's unheard of. So I am taking the opportunity. Um, I actually found in my bathroom a little Lush bag and my very, very all-time favorite bath bomb, the Butterball. Love this baby so much. So hydrating and nourishing for the skin. I'm going to pop that in the tub. Um, yeah. It's been a good day and it's been, you know, things have been really busy. I feel like it's going good. I feel like we're like all the rushing and trying to get everything accomplished has been, you know, worth it because I kind of feel like, okay, like things are getting there. You know, we are so close to done Christmas shopping. Guys, I got everything out on the bed the other day and Honestly, I have four stocking stuffers to buy, four, and two presents left for my kids and my boys, so like one for each boy, and also um, my parents left to buy four and Curtis's parents, but we already know what we're buying them, we just have to get it. So um, yeah, I'm almost done. It's unbelievable. I'm so excited. I'm going to go have this bath, guys, before Curtis changes his mind, because once I'm in there, I'm in there, okay? Um, yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Good old Sheppy is in the bathroom again tonight, and Curtis and I did a little late night crafting. <laughs> I think it's so funny. Hello, it is Wednesday, and I am in the Marshall's dressing room. I am um, making a video about holiday looks. Spoiler alert! <laughs> I also picked up this cute little active wear sweater and it is so soft. I'm definitely buying it. And if you haven't already watched that holiday outfit video, then it'll be in the description, so go take a look. There's my cart. Look at the size of this stuffy. <laughs> Who wants that in their house? All done at Marshall's and I'm about to go into Walmart, pick up a couple things um, for groceries and also I got to get Winnie a little present that she can have when she gets out of school today. Um, she actually had to get some blood work drawn today and that was her first time getting that done. So she was so, so brave. Um, the nurses actually said that she's like one of the best they've ever had. Um, when the needle went in, all she said was, oh, 
you know, like, and didn't cry. And she was so brave and I'm so proud of her. So I want to go buy her something special that she can get when she gets home from school just to show her how proud I am of her and just to encourage her. I like, my kids are the best, you guys. Like, I don't mean to brag, but <laughs> they really are the best. So it looks pretty crazy in here. Of course, it's December. I'm going to run in, get what I need, and bounce out. Oh, my goodness. And I, no, 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 I just saw a mouse. Oh, okay. I'm going to move. I'm not going to stay here. Let's try this again. <laughs> I literally was on that side of the parking lot and I said nope and drove all the way over here saying nope, 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 nope. Oh, guys, I hate mice so bad. I don't know where that little bugger came from, but he came like he scurried across like somebody else's car. Oh, I'm so itchy. Oh, okay. Nope. I'm on the other side of the parking lot. It's a huge parking lot. He won't find me. Oh, that's the grossest thing. I normally don't see stuff like that. Okay. Okay. You can only get better from here, right? Woo! All right, let's go, Walmart. <laughs> well, that escalated quickly. <laughs> Here's what I'm picking up for Winnie for her special little prize. It's a $40 special little prize, but it's something I didn't pick her up for Christmas. And I know it's something she would like to have. So I think it's worth it. She did good. I wanted to share with you a picture that Winnie drew at school today. Um, this is me because my favorite color is purple and she drew an M for Miranda or mom. She knows it's both, both of my names start with an M. Anyways, here's Winnie with her W and pink is her favorite color. And if you'll notice, there's something else right here. Yes, that would be the nurse that took her blood this morning. <laughs> Her explaining this to me was probably the cutest thing ever. My daughter's the best, you guys. How cute is that? I just finished editing my holiday haul video. It is almost 11 o'clock at night and I'm so tired. <laughs> Curtis got called for an overtime shift tonight and it was only 15 minutes away from our house. And it's at a relatively quiet base, even though he's been busy since he got there. So I'm hoping that he will get a little rest tonight at some point. Um, yeah, but I figured I would take the opportunity with his bad influence out of the house um, to get some stuff done. Because when he's here and when I'm home, when we're together, we are not productive. <laughs> we usually watch TV bum around like we don't get stuff done so I edited this video I'm glad that it's done I had such a good shopping experience today you guys I can't believe it's like redemption okay after the leggings fiasco the experience I had today was awesome except for the friggin mouse <laughs> in the Walmart parking lot oh I'm gonna have bad dreams oh why did I just think of that again <laughs> You guys don't know how bad I hate mice. Like, I really hate mice. Oh, okay. So, I've been trying to clean and get stuff done. The video just finished exporting just to my computer. I'm going to upload it tomorrow morning. Um, I'm going to re-watch this and just make sure everything is A-OK. -okay and finish cleaning up this bedroom. It is, oh, this room, like, December in my bedroom. <laughs> They're not friends. <laughs> Ugh, it gets so messy in here. Um, I got to deal with Sheppy. I got a good plan for him tonight, and it's going to be really easy. So I'm going to wrap him up and get him done. And yeah, I got to go to bed at some point, right? <laughs> so I had a super productive day. Um, some days you just don't get anything done, and some days you get everything done. And I feel like I got everything done today. And I'm just getting texts from Curtis on my phone. He's in town and the city's crazy. So he might not get that good night's sleep tonight, but if he needs to come home and sleep all day tomorrow, then that's fine. Um, he can sleep in this messy room. <laughs> I'm going to try to clean it up a little bit more, but really, if you guys could really see what was going on in here, <laughs> 
There are boxes and wrapping paper and wrap presents and presents hiding and bags and tape and presents and everything. Please tell me your room is the same. I don't want to be alone. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to shut the vlog off for tonight. I will see you guys tomorrow, but like I said in last week's vlog, it's just the next clip. So, I'll see you in the morning. Sheppy has a great hiding spot tonight. Ah, there he is. And he even brought treats. So cute. I have so much fun doing this, you guys. So the sun is just starting to set on this Thursday. We got some flurries today, so there's a little bit of snow on the ground. Just enough to make it look like Christmas. Pretty beautiful, huh? Pretty sure this is my very favorite scent. Oh my goodness. It smells like the most yummiest cookies in the world. Uh, it smells like I've been baking all day and I haven't. <laughs> Mr. Sheppy is hiding on the windowsill tonight. <laughs> so cute. Hi. <laughs> Happy Friday. We made it. Ah, it feels so good. Uh, I'm just outside here. It's Friday morning. I'm um, playing with some of my daycare kids in the snow. Got my mittens. Don't worry. It's cold. Very cold this morning. Um, yeah. I'm excited that it's Friday because I don't have anything to do tonight. This is the first Friday since September that I haven't had to have my youth group. Um, I love my youth group. I love the kids. I know it's serving such a good purpose and I love doing it, but I also love being done work on Friday, putting my feet up and relaxing, not having to plan all day Friday, you know, all the things that I have to plan and prepare everything and bring it and go and not get home till 8.30, 9 o'clock at night on a Friday night. So I'm just really excited that, holy crap, <laughs> it's Friday. It really is Friday and I can really relax. I'm so excited. Um, I got a lot of cleaning done this morning. I did laundry, uploaded another video. And um, yeah, this weekend's gonna be really busy because I'm going to finish some Christmas shopping and birthday shopping on Saturday. I also have a fundraiser to do for basketball. We have a musical we need to go to Saturday night. And Sunday is Winnie's friend's birthday party. So, you know, I gotta get the cake and everything. So it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a crazy weekend. And especially because Curtis is working all day today and all day tomorrow. So mama's got to prepare everything herself, which is fine because that's where I thrive, baby. And then he just won't get in my way. <laughs> I love you, honey. Sorry. Anyway, so that is the plan. I am probably just going to wrap up the vlog right here. So when we go back inside, I can um, get the kids their lunch and nap time will happen. And then I can quickly edit that vlog and put it together. So tonight, my boys and I can watch a movie together after we put Winnie to bed. So... Yeah, that's the plan, guys. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching this week's vlog. And I hope you guys have a really great weekend. I will see you guys very soon.